Quran, we are receiving rewards. Do you know what type of reward? The closest example that I can have in my own mind for our own situation is sometimes when we go to the fuel station and we witness the man or we, we do it ourselves sometimes when we press in order to release the fuel into our tanks and you see the literage and the amount clocking, it just goes on and on. The more you press, the faster it goes. What is it calculating? It's calculating how much you owe and how many liters are going in. Imagine that is so fast. When you read the Quran, Wallahi, the reward is faster than that. The reward is greater than that. The only thing, don't rush when it comes to the Quran. It's not going to increase that in any way. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bless us. Take your time. For one small thing, that is just a letter. We're not saying a word, a letter. You receive 10 rewards, 10. So imagine if you were to read verses of the Quran, what would happen? For every letter you get 10 rewards. The hadith says, I am not saying Alif Lam Mim is a letter. I am saying Alif is one letter, 10 rewards. Lam is one letter, 10 rewards. Mim is one letter, 10 rewards. 30 rewards just for Alif Lam Mim, 30 rewards. One reward is better than what the dunya can offer you. The whole world can offer you one reward. So what about if it is 10? What about if it is multiplied? Surely there must be a reason why Allah has made such value to this word. Number one, it's his word. Number two, the power of the message. My brothers and sisters, many of us enjoy beautiful, melodious recitation of the Quran and it stops there. Do you know what this means? We are happy. Mashallah, beautiful reciter. You want to hear this reader? Listen to him. Alhamdulillah, beautiful. We enjoy the recitation. Don't stop there. Take it further. What is this message? How come it's so beautiful? The Quran has an impact even on those who don't know what it means. Subhanallah. So ask yourself this. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala grant us all a beautiful understanding.